Okay, go ahead. Hello, I'm Deb Knight. I'm here to do your physical exam today. How are you feeling? Good, how are you? Good, very good. All right, first I'm going to put a drape on. Okay, so we're just going to lay this over your lap. And if you get uncomfortable, just let me know. So as I uh, come in, I'm going to be washing my hands, and I'm going to be cleaning my stethoscope. And then um, I'm, I, I would initially do a general survey walking in, looking for any obvious anxiety, uh, any, any central cyanosis, um, any obvious nasal flaring, audible wheezing that, uh, wheezing that I could hear, any accessory muscle use, any obvious, uh, the general respiratory pattern, any pallor, and noting any shallow respirations. And then um, I'm going to go ahead and take uh, your uh, uh, vitals here. I would, take a, I would have a temperature um, already taken, and I also would have had the height and weight obtained prior to coming in. And then um, I'm going to go ahead and take your pulse. And I would be taking the pulse, noting the rate and the rhythm times one minute. And then I'm going to go uh, ahead and at that, sorry, my mistake. At that same time, then I would look at the respirations, noting the rate and character times one minute. And now I'm going to take your blood pressure, okay? Okay. okay. So let's roll this up. Have you had your blood pressure taken before? Yep. Okay, good. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. First, I'm just going to take it. I'm going to feel the pulse here and take it up. <laughs> there we go. Right to right and left to loose. And then I would wait another minute. And the minute went by, so I'm going to go ahead and take the pressure now. pressure was beautiful. On the right side it was 100 over 70 and on the left side it must have calmed down a little because it was like 96 over 60. Thank you. And then I'm just going to roll your drape out here just a little bit. And as I'm uh, inspecting uh, the posterior thorax, I'm looking for the shape and contour. I'm looking for the AP diameter. Uh, I'm noting the spinal vertebrae, uh, the, the uh, bones, the muscles, the interspaces. Uh, looking at the chest movement and noting any unilateral lag. And now I'm going to push on you just a little bit here. You let me know if there's any soreness on the vertebrae. At least from the 
uh, in through the thoracic vertebrae. The paraspinal muscles on either side. You don't have to say that, Barbara, I'm saying it for you. Let me know if there's any tenderness. I'm going to note where the scapula is, scapular borders. I'm going to note any, um, uh, the respiratory uh, expansion. And um, I'm going to put my hands just on your back here. And then I want you to take a big, deep breath for me. Good. And then you're going to feel the back of my hand touch you. And when you feel that, would you say the word 99? I know sure. that sounds a little weird, but. 99. 99. 99. 99. Good. That was tactile fremitus. And then any abnormalities that I found on palpation, I would certainly uh, describe and go further on and, uh, and evaluate. And next, I'm going to um, be just tapping on your back a little bit, OK? And I'm going to percuss. Good. And then I'm going to go ahead and uh, listen. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm going to measure back here. I'm going to do, do a couple of little measurements. And what I would like is if uh, you could um, take a deep breath in and hold it, OK? All right. Whenever, whenever you're ready. OK? And I'm going to just mark that. You can breathe for a second. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side, okay? So whenever you're ready, take a deep breath and hold it. Okay, you can let it out. Good. And then this next time, uh, you're going to take a breath in, and then you're going to blow it out and hold it. Okay? So whenever you're ready. And I would make a mark. And relax. And again. And I would make a mark. And then I would measure both of those uh, marks in centimeters. And I should see that they are approximately three to five? Three to five mm -hmm. centimeters. OK, relax. Um, and now we're going to just take a listen, all right? If at any time during this you feel like you get kind of dizzy, please just stop, OK? And I'd like you to try to breathe in and out through your mouth. Right? So whenever you're ready, <coughs> go ahead and begin. Oh, could you do one other thing? And one thing I missed, did wrong here, and somebody should have shouted, was cross the arms. During all of that, cross the arms. Sorry, my bad. Okay, deep breath in. some special testing. And uh, special testing, it, uh, let's say that there were crackles in, and actually it's the preceptor that's telling me this, there were crackles uh, and increased tactile firmness in the right upper lobe. And uh, so that the, please do the special testing. Okay, the special testing is, this first one, I'm going to go ahead and um, ask you to uh, just say the word 99, okay? 99, 99, 99, 99, 99, 99, 99, 99, Good. The next time, this time I would like you to just say, e, okay? E, let me keep going. E, and you can take a breath if you want or hold it up e, the whole time. And then this next time, I'd like you to whisper the word 99, okay? Like 99. Okay. 99. 99. 99. 99. 
Perfect. And if there was increased bronchophony, I would hear a louder and clearer 99. If there was egophony, the E would go to A. And if there was whisper pectoriliquely that was increased, I would hear the whispering sound on the affected side. And the, all of those positives would be a sign of some sort of consolidation in that area. Okay, so now we're going to turn you around, okay? And let's, for the class, let's go down to that end, okay? It's <laughs> easier. How much time have I got left? You're at 10 minutes and 20 seconds. Left? No, no that's what you have. Four minutes. You have four minutes. Okay. Yeah. All right, could you turn your gown around, please? <laughs> <laughs> and uh, <laughs> there you go. Thank you so much. You get extra points for doing this. Really? Yes. <laughs> All right, and then again, sorry, you move your gown right here, have the hand. I mean, I'm inspecting, again, the shape and contour, the bones, the muscles, the inner spaces. I'm looking at our chest movement. I'm noticing a unilateral lag. I'm going to go ahead now and push a little bit, and I'm going to push on, these are called your costal cartilages, and I'm going to push here, and you let me know if there's any soreness. And could you do it here, and could you just... Move the breasts aside. I just, uh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Sorry, you're the best. <laughs> and you notice any tenderness. Good. And now I'm going to go ahead and uh, palpate. Could you do the same thing with the breast? I'm going to palpate the sternum and the xiphoid process. And I'm going to palp just push on your ribs a little. And if I push like that or like that, and then could you lift your arms up? Let me know if there's any soreness. Good. And then I'm going to go ahead and. Um, Ask you to remember that deep breath we did on the back side. I'm going to ask you to take a deep breath again. Just rest for a second. And now deep breath. And I've noted respiratory expansion. And then um, I'm going to ask you to say the word 99 when you feel my hand here. 99. 99. 99. Now I didn't, I could have gone maybe one more down, and in that case we would, you know, dismiss. Um, then we're going to keep on going. And this time, I'm going to do some, uh, I'm just going to tap on you again, okay? And you can just relax. And could I ask you to displace again? <laughs> Here. You could get extra points for this. Now, I'm going to ask you, I'm going to go right on the side here. And could you move the breast inward this way? Thank you. And the same on the other side. Perfect. You're going to write about this. Uh, and then now I'm going to just take a listen, okay? So same thing with your mouth open. Uh, when, you, um, when, you, when you feel my stethoscope, take a deep breath in, deep breath out, and take a break whenever you want to, okay? Bell on top. Mouth open. Thank you. Ask you to displace the breast again, please. Okay. Yes, thank mm -hmm. you. And one more. Good. And then could you lift your hand, your arm up a little bit? And again. And on this side. Good. And then I will do my special testing again, noting bronchophony, gophony, and whisper pectoriliquely. Done. Thank you. Yeah.